Arnica coffee. The hearty coffee you can drink as strong as you like, it still can't upset your nerves. Presents The Adventures of Hiram Holiday. Based on stories by Paul Gallico. Starring Wally Cox. What is that thing? Oh, Joel, I have high hopes of capturing Talia Sphinger Eye. Who? Talia Sphinger Eye, the spotted Moroccan hawk moth, commonly mistaken for the monarch butterfly, although never by the female moth. <laughs> uh, how does your moth trap work? Well, I put a piece of cabbage, Talia's favorite staple, on the posy scale. Then when the moth alights on the delicate balance, his slight weight pulls the string, which releases the net, and that completes the capture. Uh, what's the clock for? An alarm activated by the falling net to let me know when Talia has swooped down from the skies. Watch. <laughs> Hiram, come over here. Uh, just a minute, Joel. Yes, Joel? Look out there. Morocco, land of intrigue and adventure. And what are you doing trapping butterflies? Moths, Joel. And I feel that our paper would be vitally interested in a series on the metamorphic cycle of Talia's finger eye. Oh, you do? Why not? Joel. What is that? Well, it appears that I have outdone myself, Joel. Instead of a hawk moth, I've netted a hawk. Or more exactly, a hunting falcon. Well, where did he come from? I have no idea. But whereas most falcons are exclusively carnivorous, this bird is obviously a vegetarian. <coughs> Say, this is interesting. That bird's no vegetarian. He's a kleptomaniac. Unless I'm mistaken, Joel. This ring bears the seal of the 14th Kaid of Mekra Bel Ksiri. Oh, sure. Say, this is interesting. Welcome. The palace doors swing open. The palace, Joel, of Yusef Ben Maid, the 14th Kaid. I saw the palace. It's a new jewelry store opening down the street. Oh, really? Really. It's advertising. How about hunting up a place to eat? I'm starved. I'll join you later, Joel. I have to bait up again. Strictly moth food. <laughs> See you later. Pardon, City. How do you do? You got the message. I come from the palace. And the best of luck to you in your new enterprise. With you, old hawk of the desert, we shall have no need of luck. The Kaid awaits. Me? You. Something unusual. Careful how you speak, son of a camel. The desert hawk is the most powerful man in all the East. But his appearance, it is not what you would expect. <laughs> you fool. He's forced to change his appearance constantly. For every grain of sand in the desert, there is a pair of eyes which seek the hawk, and a pair of hands that itch for the price on his head. Bring him in. Yes, sir. Yasmin, back to the harem. But, sire. I have long yearned to see the desert hawk. <laughs> yes, I know. Go. Yusuf Ben Mahi, the desert hawk. Ala 
وشلان هزا کس ری گمیلی هزا شریف هزیم لهو دور ری کنی و نیز ری بی ات ایور سو همبل درز نو پلیس لیک ا پالت درز نمتین رونگ The fierce hawk assumes the guise of the timid sparrow to confuse his enemies. <laughs> I'm afraid I must apologize. Oh, for what? My face. My features are such that people constantly think they've seen me previously. Oh, not so. I have never seen you before. Oh? Besides, you carry your identification. The hawk trained to bear my ring to his master. Oh, I believe I can explain that. He just stopped by for a bite of cabbage. <laughs> and I trapped him while trying to catch a moth. <laughs> you carry your disguise quite far, even to adopting the American humor. Thank you. <laughs> a masterly disguise. <laughs> You. you have made yourself into the perfect model of a fatuous American. Well, a great deal of the credit must go to my parents. Uh, it is good that your reputation for eccentricity has preceded you. Did I think for one moment that you were not the Desert Hawk? <laughs> What's the business? The ring. Of course. Hmm. And here goes a powerful explosive, no larger than a pea. Western technology. <laughs> It can be smuggled into the fort without too much difficulty. Any particular fort? <laughs> the one where they are meeting. The Fort of El Rashid. They? They. They have kept the secret of their meeting well, but not well enough. The four most powerful men in the West, though, Hawk. Really? Wiped out in one blow by the most powerful man in the East. Sounds like quite a fellow. Who is he? <laughs> you? Well, now. <laughs> Until the time, there is everything here for your comfort. Uh, I would like to get a message to, uh, uh, to my servant. His name is Joel Smith. It is done. <laughs> you will do the bidding of the hawk. That is the hawk? <laughs> This guy, eh? Make haste. Excuse me, my friend. 